And we're back. Right, where we last left off, guys, we were about to go grab ourselves a number cut. Oh, yes, I remember. We don't have any bullets, do we? Well, I mean, luckily, luckily, this should be a fairly good place. Excuse me, thank you. To call in some supplies. Let's go for, yeah, sure, that'd do. Could use some more explosives as well, to be honest, but we'll sort that out in a minute. Good man. Now, I don't know what supplies this guy's going to bring in. Special delivery. Special delivery. Thank you. You are a gentleman, sir. Uh, I mean, yeah, we'll have the carbine, I suppose. Uh, yes. We have some RPG ammo as well. Mm, nice. All right, uh, do we want to resupply C4? Actually, we're good for C4. We've got three nuggets of C4. I mean, two nuggets of C4 pretty much wipes out anything. Hey, friend, you're dead. Sorry. Let's go snatch this whilst we're in the area. Ornamented mirror, eh? Very nice. Look out! Yes, look out. I am death. Come for you. Unless you're a number card, and then hopefully I'm just the jail warden. Call me the banker. Hey, friend. You're done. You are fried. Hope you brought some butter, because you're about to get fried. Boom. So I get reliably told by UNNC military personnel. Come here, friend. Your construction days are over. I do need to keep an eye on the time as well. Because I need to spend my time today wisely. I need to record a little bit of this. A little bit of something else. And a little bit of uh, XCOM. Okay. Let's drag this big bag of cash out. And we should be able to get another one as well. Because why settle for just one? I mean, it's a buyer's market. Okay. Alright, let's drop this carcass down here. And cool for extraction. Go get them, boys. I love that as well. Roger, this is Expo two. I am in Good here. man. So this mercenary life is actually working out quite well for these guys. Yeah, and I still need to look up as well whether you have to get all of the uh, bounties, the bonus items, to unlock all of the weapons. Get in there, you sack of shit. Another 25 G's in the bank. Almost made a million. Yeah, he's a good lad, Colonel Garrett. Okay, so there's one more that we can potentially hunt down. And then we're quite far through the game. So, Chu. I choose you. <laughs> Chu is responsible for security within Division 39. As such, he is the closest thing the Division has to an intelligence director. While Division 39 operated covertly from within President Kim's government, Chu was responsible for ensuring that neither Kim nor his closest advisors will ever learn of Song's plans. So he's a sneaky sneak. So Peng thinks his men have uncovered the location of Chiu Han Chu, the Nine of Clum. Clubs? The Nine of Clums. The Nine of Clubs. Chu is the security chief for Dung Huangbo, but his files don't make any reference to military training. Don't expect much of a fight. You'll find him north of the DMZ. Okay, well, that's easy enough to get to. Chopper's in good shape for now. Plenty of ammunition. Let's go to the DMZ. The DMZ is like where we started. Yeah. Let's go bag this sack of shit. Now, there are other helicopters in this game, as I've said later on in the game. But, this one is cheap. It has great firepower. And, to be honest, it's a solid... Oh, 
Solid option. Hello. Yeah, you gotta be careful when you come in for a landing on the helicopter. Solid fuel formula. Oof. Because you can come in too fast. And if you hit the ground fast, it's no different from... <laughs> well, driving off a cliff. Oh, hello. Didn't see that there either. Incense case. I mean, I like incense as much as the next person, but... That's quite a lot of incense. A lifetime supply of incense, if you will. There we go. Alright, not bad. Extra couple of things knocked off the list. I mean, personally, I think they've added too many collectibles in this game. I do like collectibles in games, but when they go a bit mental with it, it's... Yeah, it can be a bit much. Ooh. We do have some stuff here. Yeah, ooh, hello. Alright, let's go to town on these guys. There's a guy with a rocket launcher, he's got to go. Let's waste these missiles. Hopefully, they're not going to keep spawning from this place. Nice. Yeah, I guess actually they might keep spawning from this place. But if we could take the majority of them out. There we go. Work you over. Ah, lovely. Ooh. Okay, I thought that was a missile I could hear sailing then. But no. I mean, RPGs we can kind of deal with. But when they start getting the homing stuff, the lock-on stuff, that's brown trouser time. Ooh, yeah, he was an RPG guy. Okay. I don't mean he likes playing Dungeons and Dragons or Final Fantasy. Okay, there was another one. I saw it. There we go. Nice. Phoenix head sword. Sounds good. Okay. You, sir, can piss off. I think that's everything here. Yeah, not bad, not bad. A couple of extra things knocked off the list. These are definitely going to get harder to find, obviously. Alright, let's get in the air. Might have to start thinking about rearming this bad boy. Now, rearming helicopters is different. I think there's like a winch involved or something. Yes, there is. Right. Okay. Uh, any of these? There's no ammo there. Uh, there's no vehicle ammo around. Or armor, but that's fine. Right, let's continue looking for our friend's song. Alright. So, East Pongyang. We need to go north of the DMZ. And we are disguised as the enemy, which... Oof. There is a SAM site there. SAM sites are bad. Bad news. But hopefully if we keep being sneaky sneak, we're okay. Ah, oh, bollocks. Really don't want to lose our disguise around uh, North Korean SAM sites. There we go. There he is. Ooh. And possibly a fresh helicopter. Uh, yeah, that's a very fresh helicopter. Right. Luckily, there's no lock on guys here. You're fucked. But there is a spawn location for them. So we need to be careful. Damn it. Can you, like, get away from your bodyguards, please? Oh, we killed him. Oh, no. No. We killed him. Uh. Well. I wonder. Where did we last save it? Let's look at our bounties. Uh, 14, 13, 3, and 4. 
14, 13, 3, and 4. 14, 13, 3, and 4. 14, 13, 3, and 4. Uh, which one do we load? 14. Oh. No, we should be okay, I think. 14, 13, 3, and 4. Oh, but we do lose our helicopter, which is utter bullshit. 14, 13, 3, and 4. Yeah, okay, so we haven't actually lost anything. Okay, cool. So what we'll do is go take him on foot. Because there is a helicopter there. So, and he was over here somewhere. Right, guys, I am going to skip. I will see you back here in a minute. And we found some more goodies on the way. Right, let's go clear these guys up. There we go. Beautiful. Suck my carbine. So, what have we got here? Yoink. Prehistory earrings. Prehistory? Like from before history began. Ah, looks like they shot down something here. Hmm. Well, it's ours now. They shot down a plane for some prehistory earrings. I mean, sure. Whatever floats your boat, I guess. Right. Onwards. Well, looks like we're getting a bit of an upgrade, guys. We're getting a T-54, which is... I think the North Koreans best vehicle which is kind of curious when you think about it get in buddy yeah he can get in here yeah t54 is like the best thing for these uh, North Koreans which is I guess kind of sad when you think about it but it's powerful nowhere near as good as the Chinese one but trying to think what the allies get I'm sure they get like an M1 I'm sure they do really we're just gonna miss every shot probably there we go two shots to bring down a guard tower that's pretty good to be honest I suppose as we're in a tank we can just make our own road although preferably a road that doesn't involve continuously going up fences there we go. Well, it looks like our gunner's having fun anyway. Ah, God. Oh, there's lots of North Koreans here. Lots of North Koreans here. One shot and he's on fire. Oh, and I just killed our gunner. That was not intended. Another one down. Well, we're really punishing the NKs now, aren't we? Now, is that there a fresh T-54? Actually is. Alright, cool. Yoink! Is that a T-54? Yeah, it's a T-54. <laughs> I love that. Just chuck a nade in the top and be done with it. Fresh tea. Okay, nice. Let's keep rolling. And keep shooting. And keep running over. Although that wasn't quite as hoped. Okay, cool. I mean, we're deep in North Korean te um, territory now, which you can tell by all the tanks and shit that are here. But that's just more money in our pocket. Because every North Korean vehicle or soldier we kill is more money in our bank. Like so. Yeah, they really will try and take a tank on. Now, north of the DMZ, I'm guessing... Guessing we want to go this way. Uh, now, I know this isn't exactly Skyrim, and this isn't a horse, but... Uh, yeah, let's not try that. Right, I'll catch you guys in a minute. Let's go back. Safety, please. Uh, right, hang on. We have a stuck tank. 
There is a way. Oh god, oh god. Ugh. Yeah, we go. See, Jen, she is stronger than you'd give her credit for. I bet you didn't think she could move a 60 ton vehicle like this. I bet you didn't. I bet you're expecting her to be a weak and feeble woman. Uh, no, Jen. I mean, <laughs> when you're as strong as that, you can't have all the intelligence in the world. Enter vehicle, please. Jen, thank you. There we go. Roll back down. Okay, now we're on the winning side. Uh, are we stuck again? We're stuck again, aren't we? We're stuck. Uh, old games and their crazy physics. There we go. It's getting a tank stuck on pebbles. Is that even a thing? And now we're sliding down. There we go. Nice. I'm surprised we haven't broken our gun yet either. Don't mind me, guys. No help needed. Just a lady that's broken down on the side of the road. She'd probably be very grateful, you know, if you helped her out. She'd probably send you to heaven. One bullet at a time. Really? We're stuck here again? How? Come on, be a good tank. Thomas the tank. Come on. Don't let me down. Come on, almost there now, Thomas. Jen, don't kick it with your feet. Oh, oh. Hey, you know, Jen, you do you, yeah? Ow! Dude! That is not how you help a lady. You fucking savage. I've heard things about you North Koreans, but I never thought they were true. Yeah. Some of it's true, I suppose, but come on. Um, you dick! You've ruined that for me. You utter dick penis man. Can we now get in the tank? God, for fuck's sake. I mean, honestly. And you better keep your nose out of it as well, mate. Oh, of course. Everybody's got a voice. And everybody's got something to say. Ah, that's what's wrong with the world, I tell you. There we go. Yes, 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 yes. Come on. Yes, yes. Let's get this crate ship moving. Yes, where there's a will, there's a way. There we go. Told you. She'll send you to heaven one bullet at a time. Is that a health kit? No, it's a piece of rubble. There you go. You deserved that, and you know you did. Right, I will catch you guys up in a minute. Looky, looky. Yink. Ooh, anti-tank rocket drop available. Nice. That was worth it. And right, guys. I think we're on the right road now. Ah, there we go. Okay, let's have a little look around, shall we? And the one thing that is annoying me is this doesn't appear to be... There we go. That They take an awful lot of shells. They really do. Right. So, what's up here? Let's have, ooh, raining hell. What is up here? Let's have a little look, shall we? Always drop our tank here. Oh, God. I don't think we have enough shells to deal with all these guys. But I guess we can try. Alright. Our soldier is running away for some reason. Whoa! Yeah. We have enemy artillery fire. Or enemy RPG fire. Yeah, my god. These really take some shots. Impressively so. I'm pretty sure they're not that resilient to C4, but I might be wrong. Holy shit. Right, let's try that again. We need to learn these things. Oh, God. For later on in the game. C4. Let's try two nugs of C4. Whoa! Okay, that... 
does work. C4 is really dangerous. I hate the way um, that you, the way you control C, right, so basically you select it and then you place it, but then it instantly, instantly switches to the trigger. And then to select it again, you have to push up, push up again and hold down the trigger hold down the explosive button so if you do it too quick and the game doesn't react you blow yourself up okay once more guys once more feeling and we're back guys right so it looks like all of the destruction that we cause actually stays which is actually quite a cool feature I like that um, this is something that uh, we started to see a little bit of with the original Xbox having that juicy hard disk All right, let's see how many RPGs does it take to take out a bunker Bear in mind we can hold four Okay, well it definitely takes more than four Some of these buildings are just crazy strong I guess Let's do this one at a time one And uh, one, I guess, because it's all we've got. Bugger. There we go. Yeah, those bunkers are crazy strong, man. Way stronger than I would have thought they would have been. But there's lots of ammo here. Ah, we don't need the assault rifle. I would have liked some RPG rounds, but of which there was lots. Okay, let's jump back into the tank and keep pushing forwards. See what's up here. So this is probably where one of the cards will be later on. But I suppose if we clean it out now, we're going to save ourselves some time. Not sure. Traitor? What are you talking about? Dick. I guess if you get too close... That, ooh. Ooh. Shut your hole, sir. Now. I'm not sure if we can bring this down. Might be worth trying some artillery, you know. Let's have a go. Artillery is kind of risky, though, don't you think? Let's go for airstrikes. Ooh. 50 Gs. I mean, we could try it. Surgical strike. Roger, right, let's get out of here. Bomb screen. Yep, surgical strike actually does it in. Good to know. I mean, it's 45,000, which is not chump change. But, you know, if it gets the job done. We... I don't want that good. We've got that restocked. Nice. We'll have. Ooh. <laughs> I guess there's our 50G back. Happy with that. Yeah, so I think these stay destroyed. I'm not 100% sure. Don't quote me. So, like, if we load the game uh, after we completely turn the Xbox off, I guess I'm hoping these will still be destroyed. I also don't think you get anything for destroying them. Apart from, you know, you stop the stem of enemy units flowing in. Now, let's go the other way. Let's see if we can get the ace. Right. Disguised as Korean. Please don't be disguised as Korean. For some reason, the Allies don't like us. Can't think of why. Got to be something we did somewhere. Okay, going up, going up. All right, this is gonna be sketchy. I think this is where the guy that we want is. You fucking survived that. 
I tell you, the damage modeling, hitboxes, and physics are definitely... Look at that! You just tanked it. What a champion. Okay. <laughs> oh, the tank jump. The jeep jumped. Sure. Dude, you're about to get squished. I'm not even sorry, bro. Ooh, rounds out. Nice. At least this tank does reload pretty quick. I think they all load quick as they... Yes, this is where we need to be. I think they all reload about the same rate. Sandbags are unbelievably strong, apparently. Which is fine. Right, now, we want to be quick here because we don't want that helicopter taking off. Oh, God. For me, I was here ages ago. For you guys, it was like, you know, 10 minutes ago, but fuck. Right, let's get out of that because this thing's basically beached. Can we have a weapon, please? We've only got RPGs. I mean, that's beautiful in a way. I did not know that you could pick up two of the same weapon. So well, well, well. Dude, nope, you're out of here. And I'll take your AK for good measure. I cannot believe we have two RPGs. I can't even believe you can have two RPGs. You can have two of the same weapon. What? I mean, I actually think that's pretty rad, to be honest. But definitely not the most useful thing in the world. And these guys are going to infinitely spawn, aren't they? Yes! Right, let's get the surgical strike out. That's expensive, but I think it's worth it. Okay, the surgical strike did not hit what we wanted. That is another problem. Can you die, please? Thank you. Now, you be a good nine of clubs and sit there and think about what you've done. Okay, so the surgical strike totally and utterly failed, which is wonderful. So this grommet's going to continuously spawn. Oh, they're so expensive, man. Um, best angle of attack. Let's try and work these things out. What if we aim it there? But as you can see, even with all of our wealth... No, it doesn't hit. They're really inaccurate. That's a lot of money to be throwing away for no reason. Um, and grenades aren't going to sink this thing. No way. Uh, well, I mean, I guess... I guess there's nothing we can really do then. Uh, pick you up. Now, I think we can load him into the helicopter. I kind of remember that being a thing. I mean, maybe we can, but not that helicopter. Damn it. Can you not shoot me like that? Thank you. And you can piss off too. Let's see what we can do with all of our RPGs. Alright, well, I mean, there's a load of RPG ammo gone. And one more. I, mean, I guess we can just keep picking up more RPG ammo. Yeah, kind of. How much HP do these things have? Damn. That's crazy. There's more RPGs in there, but of course we can't get them. Uh, right. Why can't... There we go. There we go. That do. Yeah, definitely not. Um, the landing zone is not clear. Really going to be relying on those surgical strikes. Alright. Fine. I can see where this is going. Yeah. 
And let's dump these two into it. Although it appears to have stopped. Yeah. It appears to have stopped spawning dudes now. Which is cool. Alright, beacon. Out. So we just spent basically a hundred grand on that. For nothing. This is why I don't like spending out money in mercs. Damn. 100 grand. It's more than 10% of our money for an ineffective airstrike. Never mind. We've definitely learned something here today. I don't know what we've learned, but we've learned something. Alright, let's go chuck this guy in the back. Alright, oh, okay, I guess it has to be in a certain door. That's fine. In you go, buddy. Oof. Alright. Another guy in the bank. Nine of clubs. Well, I mean, we got some money back, I suppose. As the game goes on, we start getting more money for these guys as well. Because obviously, things that we can buy in the shop get a lot more expensive. And they get much bigger boom, I think. For a start, if memory serves, and it might not serve, I'm pretty sure with airstrikes, we get like a £5,000 bomb. A gift from our friends across the border. I wonder if that's more accurate. So, with that, that is the end of this video, guys. And we have pretty much dismantled this whole area and these these whole uh, this whole operation the clubs are falling just a few left and we're nearly halfway into getting this guy now you don't have to get all of them Okay, you can just complete the missions and you can get enough, fill the intel bar up and then you can go straight for the ace if memory serves. But where's the fun in that, you know? So, I'm going to leave it there guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. I know I have. And as always, till next time.